Morning folks, flask is ready and we have crisps. The picnic is ready folks, the sun is shining, got shades on, we'll listen to the view. Sco Palace, here we come. That's the eternal question folks, will Bro be on time? He's got 10 seconds left to get here, that's all he's got. Oh hang on, hang on, we see him, Bro has a revade, he's made it bang on time. Right, folks, we're here at Scream Palace, but it seems to be a bit of a disaster because we're going to have to pay. It's a, it's a horrific amount we're going to have to pay. It's something like, how much is a Mary? Um, I don't know. £6.95 for an adult. You might get him for a child <laughs> or, or a, a wayward rebel individual. You might get that sort of... Or we could sneak in for free. Hello, Julie. Now, this is my uh, niece and this is my Hello. wife. <laughs> <laughs> Just for today only. Yes, right. Listen, you're my daughter, right? so we're going to pretend to be a family. And you, 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 you could be a senior citizen. Yes. So we're having a bit of a, a, co a confab about what to do to get in. Bro and Mum are way down having a look at the moment. Right, folks, we've we've bit the bullet. We've paid. Right. This is really bad. We're going in to Scoon Palace, folks, and the rain has come on just to add to our woes today. Did you enjoy that, Mary? Paying. Right. That's that's it. We finished by. That's it. We're leaving now. Oh, hang on, we're having a, a family portrait to start with here. Just the girls on their, their own. Right, what are these flowers called, Mary, please? Rhododendrons. Rhododendrons. Are they rhododendrons? They are beautiful, aren't they? Look at the colours. Very vibrant. Look at those. Wonderful. And I don't, I don't think are those rhodod I don't think they're rhododendrons, but anyway, what a beautiful place, Scoon Palace is. Lovely so far, isn't it? Something interesting here, it's a nice tree. Crikey, look at the size of this thing, chaps. It's got a massive branch. This is the David Douglas Trail. Sudosugo Menzizi. Hmm, all right. Now, this very tree here in the grounds of Scoon Palace was growing from a seed that was brought over from the Columbia River. Excellent. What have we found here, Kirsty? What is it? Kirsty and I were exploring this thing here. What's this? It's like one of those pig trough things. Pig trough things. Well, what is it? Hang on, we're going to have a proper look. Oh, I don't really know what this is. Hmm. Is it a model of the Stone of Destiny, do you think? Hmm. Is it the Stone of Destiny? Is it really? Right, we seem to have a mass, a mass gathering here at this uh, pavilion. What have we found here, folks? We have found the kitchen garden. Please enjoy your walk around, but please do not forget to close the gate. Right, Mary, we're going in. Okay. Oh, we're in. Doesn't seem to be a lot here, just a few sticks and things at the minute. Hmm. Right, well, you know, we also have a mysterious object off the day. So here it is today, folks. What is this mysterious object? It's in the wall. It's got a screw in. There's actually a handle here as well. Um, it says height when raining on it. What could it be? What do you think it is, Mary? Um, it might be... Hmm, interesting. Something to rain. Well, check out these trees, folks. Yay! Wow. What are they called? Uh, Western Hemlock. Western Hemlock. All right. Excellent. Look at this chap here. Wow. Very old. All right, what's this we found here? Like a, is that a grave to a pheasant, do you think? It might be a pheasant grave. Oh, let's go and investigate, Mary. Come on, let's go. I don't want to stop. I am. I'm actually right. sure what this is, folks. It could be a, a peacock's grave, though, quite possibly. Or is it a turkey? I don't know. Is there anything on it? No indication as to what it is. Never mind. Right, I've come off the beaten track, folks. I don't think I'm supposed to be here, but um, we have found... What's this? Another mystery object here. What is this? I have found here. It's an emergency lifeline. In case of emergency in the water, please use the lifeline. Oh, it's just a, a safety thing. Is the water here? Oh, hang on. Right, that must be it there. The marshland, right. 
That's probably why I'm not supposed to be here. Right, I'm back and join the family. I found some sort of sluice gate here. Oh yeah. Right again, I've just stumbled into this rather unusual little area. Some fantastic bird noises here. There was one in particular, was up that tree there somewhere? I heard it. Let's listen. Hmm. Very unusual. There's one in particular. Right, that's the maze, folks. We found the maze and that's where we're going. Right, here it is, the maze, folks. Right, in we go. We're in the maze. And let's see if we can... Hello, Julie. Hello. Here, here we go. Here we go. Right, folks, we're in the maze now. And uh, I think I've just come to a dead end already, have I? Let's just go for a wander. I've got the photograph on my phone in case I get lost, or maybe be Kirsty can help me. Oh, I'm totally lost in the maze, folks. I can hear a fountain. That must be the centre. I, I, I could cheat. <laughs> I did. <laughs> oh, that's not fair. Look. Oh, we've made it. Here we are, we've made it into the centre. We have a naked lady. Hey! You made it. Right, Julie, go and strip off and do the pose. Right, I've actually made it into the centre of the maze and there's this lovely statue. A rather attractive lady there. Now we've got to get out of the place. How do I get out, folks? Guide me out. Is this the way out, folks? No, there's a dead end this way, seemingly, so I'm going the wrong way. All right, okay. Back we go. Now, this is the thing about these mazes. People just barge through the hedges to get, and there's a hole there, so I got through that to get to the, uh, to get to the end of it. So that spoils the purpose of the whole thing, doesn't it, really? Anyway, we're up here. It's like that final bit of the shining. Wait for me, wait for me. Lost in the maze again, folks. So we Kirsty is uh, getting me out of here. I can hear, bro, bro, where are you? Oh, I made it, I'm out of the maze, folks. Here we go, made it. He's lost, bro's still in there. There's bro, he's trying to get out of the maze, still lost. Come on, we're starving, waiting on you. This should be the funny part of the day here. Fall, 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 fall. <laughs> Mum's going, the, mum's going the sensible way. Oh, yes, there she is. No, probably not. <laughs> Come on, Mum. Well done. Right, today's picnic. What's everybody got today? Thins again, is it? Thins, thins, thins. thins. I've actually got a roll today. I've got ham and coleslaw roll for myself. More thins and tea and coffee and everything today. I've got thin flatbread. Very good. Ooh. Okay, go. <laughs> We're here testing whether Mr. Chop, which is Aldi or Lidley, Aldi or Lidley, giant buttons are the same as dairy milk, but they just don't have the same sort of feel about them. No. But they're not too bad. They're okay. Well, what's... And they are, they're actually, they are resellable. How much are they? So you can sell them again. <laughs> oh, no, sorry, resealable. I beg your pardon, I beg your pardon. What, what do you think of them, Rosie? What do you think of the, the chocolate buttons, Rosie, please? Yeah, you were fine, you were okay. Nana? Not as good as you had before. No. Mm. Definitely not. Mm. Definitely tastes the difference. Mm. What about you, Nana? Uh, I can't do it. I 
dropping something at the time. Oh. I, really, I thought they were dropping it. I didn't. What about you, bro? I would say I like them, but the real test is, would be when they've been in the fridge. Yes. Mm. <laughs> Good call, then, right? Yeah. Christy? The ERC ones are better. <laughs> yeah, but the cadmium ones are really very good. Yeah, nice nice. It's the so the general product consensus is it's okay, but it's not exactly the product placement. Yes. <laughs> oh, yeah. oh, we've had a disaster, <laughs> folks. What's happened? <laughs> the have the, the yeah. Mary's Much dropped them all. <laughs> Look! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a tragedy! <laughs> the one's on the seat will be alright. There's right. one there, that's a safe one, I've got that one. <laughs> oh, oh no! <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Well, folks, now we have. Uh, now, pay attention. We have uh, done the fun bit, we've had the uh, the maze and the little walk around the, the Pintum. Now we're going to go into the historical part of Schoon Palace. So, do come and join us. <laughs>